get into excellence how do we get people to excellence which is what we want right we want how do we help our people to give the best of themselves to do the best work yeah and as you are discussing a lot of that is about us how do we talk to them so one of the learnings is studying failure doesn't get us to excellence and let that sink in studying failure will help us stop failure but not move to success if you all are familiar with uh, hersberg's theory hersberg's theory of motivation if you are dissatisfied by reducing dissatisfaction doesn't bring you to satisfaction it just brings you to a state where you are no longer dissatisfied yes neutral now from there you need to help them now to be satisfied <laughs> it's like if i take away your salary you are going to be dissatisfied correct but giving you your salary salary won't make you satisfied because that's a norm you expect it anyway are you all understanding yeah so come in come into jaik right just because there is ac and there is a table and chairs and you get lunch that doesn't make you motivated because that's a norm you expect that <laughs> but if it's not there you'll be very upset are you seen the reverse right yeah so studying failure won't help us get to success for example the more we study why divorces happen doesn't tell us anything about how to have a happy marriage <laughs> right studying at an exit interview we do this right exit interview you ask people why are you leaving what makes you leave but that doesn't tell us anything about why some people are not leaving and stay <laughs> you see you see the difference yeah so it tells us okay why people are leaving but it doesn't say okay so darian has been here for 15 years why is he not going and he's doing great work so not that he's just staying there and getting his salary he's not doing great work why what's happening there right studying depression doesn't tell us anything about how to be happy <laughs> just how to be less depressed <laughs> I understand it. So studying failure doesn't take us to success, right? Fixing a grammar in an essay will give us a grammatically correct essay, but may not get an essay that is fantastic. It's grammatically correct, but does it do the job? Does it get you to act? Maybe not. Full stop. Pick it up, right? Yeah. So another example: if you show a teacher when students lost interest and show what to do to fix it, so the teacher can now learn. Okay, how to wake up a student if they are falling asleep, right? But not how to inspire the students to learn. But well, that's a different thing, right? So hopefully you all are getting that. However, excellence and failure have a lot in common. So if you say if you do a study of bad leaders, bad leaders, and you see what are the characteristics of a bad leader, and you see okay, bad leaders have big egos. All right, with me so far. You see, bad leaders have big egos. So now we tell at a leadership training program, I come and say, guys. bad leaders have big egos so if you want to be a good leader you should not have a ego now would that help you become a leader no because when you go and study good leaders you find they have big egos also you get understand the point right yeah so some of the best leaders most inspirational leaders have huge egos you really think wow i'm good i can inspire you and isn't that why we get inspired right yeah So studying failure doesn't get us to excellence, right? Another example: you study bad sales people and say, you know, if you are a sales guy, you can't take rejection personally. If somebody refuses the sale, you just need to move on to the next one, right? So if you are getting upset when someone rejects, you are not a good sales guy, right? But then you study the best sales guys; they also get upset because they are personal investor. They feel the product is good, and they get very upset when somebody doesn't, you know, believe what they are saying, and that's what makes them a good sales guy. Again, studying failure doesn't get us to excellence. Did you understand that? Yes, guys, is that a good idea? Studying failure doesn't get us to excellence.